All right, so I don't actually do an intro for this one, so let me actually explain what's happening for this. First of all, yes, I'm dressed as a wizard. Yes, I look incredible, and yes, my bunny ears are coming out of like a little flap in the hood. Also, yes, I have flowers in the corner in, in the little pocket there. Anyways, this world has a bunch of mods downloaded onto it, and all the mods I'm using, and also all the texture packs I'm using, will be listed down below in the description. Um, another thing, I'm a little ill while recording this, which means I sound horrible, and also all the background noises are horrific. But, 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 regardless, I um, went back over and voiced over some of the stuff, so it really does end up just feeling a bit more like um, me recording something and then reacting to it, which is weird. It's, a, it's an experience for sure, it'll feel like a fever dream, but it's an experience that I want you to stick with until the end. I have no bribes this time. Unlike last time, where I splashed myself with every potion imaginable. Let's ignore that. Anyways, um, please do stick by if you enjoy the video. Subscribe. <laughs> that, that feels cringe as hell to say. But yes, please do stick around and watch me both roast myself and hype myself up. Somebody just spawned in and what? What is this? <gasps> There's a creature. Oh, I have no idea what this is. Should I? Oh, I might. That's <laughs> making zombie noises. I'm guessing it has the same comments as this. <gasps> Another creature. Okay. <laughs> um, keep inventory is on in case anyone is worried about my survival skills. But not good. Okay, and now we're just gonna watch me cut trees. Such riveting content, really. Now, typically, I would have just skipped past this bit. Like, there's not a lot going on. But, um, as I mentioned earlier, I have a lot of mods in this. And you're gonna see very quickly that the thing is, when you're not smart and you download a shit ton of mods, Oof. Certain things are not working. Uh. It's fixed! Oh, there's so many planks now. Alright, that's lovely. Okay, let's make a crafting table. And frozen ocean. Hmm. Look at the foxies. Ah, oh, they're so cute. And some burbs. Can I make it my burb? Oh. It seems. <gasps> 
Cliff. There's one of them plants that killed me earlier. And it's about to be nighttime. Sir. So, some okay, now let's rob these people blind. And so robbed them I did, even taking their bed and then putting it back for whatever reason. Uh, I don't remember if there was much in this, but yeah, I harvested all their crops, kept breaking the ice, but I kept turning back into ice because I didn't have any torches so I couldn't keep any near it. So I just kept freezing up again, trading with some villagers for food. And made mistakes. <sighs> so stupid. I'm so stupid. I am the biggest idiot in the world. You really are. Should I just let him kill me? Forgive me? Ooh, iron helmet. Plus regular iron, plus obsidian, plus food. Meow, meow, meow. I'm sorry, why do I breathe so loudly? Jeez.
Oh yeah, I updated it to my overgrown pack. Which is just one I made for myself. It looks kind of garbage, I'm not gonna lie. But oh well. And here we dig and go into, I think this is a completely different cave because I couldn't find the previous one. So yeah, you're, you're just gonna watch a sped up recording of me stumbling through a cave, finding iron, and I think I die very quickly this time. Do I not? Whoa! Sexy. PvP skills? Boom. I don't need PvP because I don't got any fr oh. Literally never felt so cool. And we're back with the cooler, sexier Tia. So, what are we doing now? We're, we're just we're just going in a cave. Um, I think I spot diamonds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna talk about stuff now. I've got literally nothing that interesting happens, but I don't talk or do anything of interest for the rest of the video, so guess what? This is a podcast now. Welcome. <laughs> oh boy, what, what, what do people do on podcasts? Um, women don't lo want me. I, <laughs> no, 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 let's not be rude, let's not be crass, people might be interested in the sped up caving session going on here. It, it really was just one of those times where I, like, got into playing the game. Caving is honestly one of my favorite things, because you just go around and you collect shiny things, and it's it's wonderful, really. I think over the years I never improved despite playing Minecraft for a long time. Probably because I took very long breaks, like, and I never really got too into it again after I was like 10, I think, because I didn't have anyone to play with after I was like 10, which is kind of unfortunate, but oh well, that's life. But like, ooh, how did I survive that? I'm kind of, I'm kind of a god, huh? <laughs> this is just gonna be me bragging for like, however long this goes on. There's a lot of this in the video. You're gonna hear me talking. This is like, I'm doing a react video for my own video, so I know what's gonna happen. Which I feel like a lot of react channels already know what's going to happen. I believe no one, like, my trust issues are so shit that like whenever I see people reacting to like playing what was that game back in the day where they like can your pet and then you know you get your pet to do various different things and then whoa at the end you can your pet oh my god please be vegetarian <laughs> And it's like, whoa, that's so dark and edgy. I don't believe anyone who did like blind playthroughs of that game and acted like, oh, I've never played this before, or I don't know what's happening here because you only found out about that game because somebody else told you what happens at the end. Don't lie to me, don't lie to yourself. And most importantly, don't lie to me again. Because I'm the most important person. There's a creeper. Whoop. Anyways, I feel like I should go back and redo the textures I did for the flower armor. But like, I don't- I lost all motivation because I made it and I was like, Whoa, this is like a really cool fun idea. I can't just- oh. Ooh, shiny thing.
fucking delayed reaction. Please drop, please drop. Okay. I dropped something. Hmm. What is this? Abyssal Dracolite. Bro, the background sounds in my own recording are gonna clash with the ones I add on later. Anyways. Um, where was I? Where was I? Oh yeah, the armor. Yeah, so I made that, and I was like, oh, it's kind of cute, a little clunky, because, like, the old skin I used to use, um, but, oh. Oh, diamonds. Ooh, diamonds. Oh, shit, more diamonds. Oh, shit, more diamonds. Any more? Hello? <laughs> I'm rich. I really was ill recording this, huh? I... <laughs> How? What? Why do you say hello to the stone? Gina, you weirdo. I love you though, because you're me and there's no one I love more than myself. Anyways, going into lava. Lava looks so tasty. Like Minecraft lava specifically, it looks like melted Cheetos, but like the flaming hot ones. And that makes me so hungry. I got Momo's for lunch and I'm so excited for it to be like a reasonable lunch eating time so I can eat it. They're like chicken mo Momo's, um, cause uh, are Momo's? I don't know. It's like dumplings. I don't remember what the difference was between Momo's and dumplings, but I'm Indian, so they're Momo's. Anyways, so here we are, just like, wandering about. I think if I had to be any Minecraft mob, it would probably be like a silverfish. If there was like anything... What, what are these topic jumps? Anyways, if I could be a Minecraft mob, I think it would be like a silverfish. Or an enderman. No, it would be a silverfish. I like showering. Enderman must be so smelly. Although I guess there are like other ways to clean yourself without water. Also, look at me absolutely demolishing these skeletons. What a god, honestly. <laughs> All three people who are still watching this somehow are probably way better at PvP and could probably kick my ass. Edit like any day, so hearing me say, whoa, I'm such a god, it's probably a little annoying, but like, fuck you, your opinion doesn't matter. You might be objectively good at something, but I'm figuratively good at something, and that means a lot more. I technically graduated from high school English, I think, as long as I passed my exam. So, you can't even say shit to me about that. Say shit to me about that. Wow, Tia. This is both me consistently roasting myself and also like building myself up. Why was there a duck in the cave? Sir? Why do you ignore that? Tia. <laughs> you weirdo. Anyways, um, more diggy diggy. What am I going to do with all of this iron? Really. I, I love stalagmite caves, by the way. They look so good. Like, they feel nice and creepy. And like, you know, sometimes I still feel like Minecraft is that game. Especially because like, I play- oh. Okay, we're sleeping. Sir? Chests. Okay, that makes sense. Please explain what you're doing while you do it, man. See, originally these voiceovers were just gonna be doing the sped up bits, but like now I gotta do it everywhere. Cause this loser lamo. <laughs> loser lamo. Oh yeah, you're organizing and that you feel so good about yourself. 
piece of shit. That's no organization. You're just dumping things in. Why are you keeping- oh, okay, I think I burned that pickaxe later. <laughs> you got the sniffles? So sad. You can hear, like, the TV in the back, because I had to boost up my own voice. That gets boosted up to- Why did I not use, like, any sort of earphones? I don't have a mic. I just ooh, use ooh. Griffin special food. A diamond mace. That's like 12 attack damage. There's only 7. They can make coal equipment, but they seem useless. I can almost make a sandwich. <laughs> With cheese and chicken. Wow. A diamond from the steel. What's the difference? Now let's try and find the more. Hmm. I don't know why the sandwich from earlier is so cool. Oh, it is, kid. Good, uh, good observation, Chia. So proud of you. The silence. Uh, I think I died pretty quick this time around. Look how fast that pickaxe animation goes. Oh boy, you don't realize how sped up it is. It feels like one of those, you know, those videos where it's like how tall people get glasses of water, how short people get glasses of water, and it's just like a really tiny little rodent, and it's like super sped up. I think. It feels like that. Anyways, here's a mine shaft. Isn't that cool? Wait, an anglerfish? I'm looking at shit to craft here. What is a potato sword? Anyways, we're back in the mines, cause, you know, that's where children go. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Anyways, the potato sort of really confused me. Also, by this point, I've made an iron mace, which felt really cool to wield, but didn't feel like... What? <laughs> Anyways, it didn't feel like... It feels like you have to walk around with a sword in your hand in Minecraft. I don't know why, it feels like one of those rules. 
like throw dicks straight down or whatever fucking kids do. Um, I feel like one of the rules is just like, don't walk around without a sword in your hand. But look at the angler fish. You can only see a little bit of it, and but dude, I'm I'm scared of like the ooh damn. Anyways, I'm scared of like the deep ocean in real life. Seeing shit like anglerfish that's that big in Minecraft, I don't know if they're that big like normally. And now I'm going to Google how how big are anglerfish? How big are anglerfish in real life? Compared to humans, compared to humans. I don't think they're that large. It's a foot and a half. Oh my god, they're big. Maybe the guy's just small. They're rarely as large as a man's fist, and I'm I'm quite a bit larger than a man's fist. I'll have you know, good sir. But like, there is this one specimen, uh, according to the New York Times, uh, from a depth of 2.2 miles off West Africa. It was a foot and a half long and it looks horrific what it's so big oh that that's terrifying they can grow up to 3.3 feet long and humans are like five five i i mm, like I'm five, six, five, seven, I think. That's terrifying. And also, there's a perfectly average height. Fuck you. Anyways, cobwebs and stuff and looting shit. Hmm. Yeah, anglerfish. Horrific. You know what else is. Ooh, lava soup. I feel like I was talking about how lava looks like really melted flaming hot Cheetos. Did did anyone also like anyone listening this far? Did you guys also like have that thing where hear that rumor as a kid where like flaming hot Cheetos are made of plastic and if you melt it <laughs> if you melt it it'll just like char and turn black. I feel like cheese like mac and cheese i feel like that does that does it not is that also plastic is that why it does that anyways i've never i've never done that to the hot cheetos because i feel like that's a waste of flaming hot cheetos i'd rather have them like burn in my stomach acid thank you and i remember like vividly when i heard that from an older girl um like I remember I hear heard it with some friends and like one of the other girls just said Oh Well, you know, plastic waste is a big problem. I don't mind if they turn that into flaming hot Cheetos. At least we're eating it then. And you know what? Kinda true. True and real. Maybe instead of turtles eating, you know, the plastic and that's awful. Maybe it should be me. I should eat the plastic. I'll be like the plastic eater. Not the hero Gotham City needs, but the hero Gotham City deserves. <laughs> no, wait, I'll do it right. Not the hitty Gotham not the hitty. Not the hero Gotham City wants, but the hero they need. <laughs> Anyways, anglerfish are scary. Eating plastic, probably not the best for me, but like I've probably done it considering how many microplastics exist in our world. It's horrific, really. Save save the planet. Being green is cool, being green is I died. On a stalagmite? And no reaction? Chia! Alright, we can make the mace. That is not what you should be focusing on here. Oh, and you guys make like redstone and lapis copper. That's interesting. Should I try the iron potato sword? What does this do? Will it like make pigs come towards me? Then 
I'm honestly still a little aware of that carnivorous plant. It's fucking terrifying. And there she is. Switching to the potato sword. It does the same amount of damage as an iron, as a diamond sword. The potato makes but it there's strong. Like the cookie salmon. sword. There's no animal that like likes cookies, other than humans. And no way would another player fall for that. So you can't even eat the potato. What's the point? I get very worked up about this potato sword. Okay, now, yeah, th that's just how I ended it when I did the recording. I know, horrific, what the hell? And also, what are these little bulges on my hands? It's those puppy sleeves Howl from Howl's Moving Castle has. Google it. Anyways, um, thank you for making it this far, if you somehow did. Um, as a prize, why don't- look, I have- yeah, you might also notice very quickly that my entire hotbar is broken, and that's because there's a broken resource pack on this world. Why? I don't really, I don't, I don't quite recall. But look at that. It, don't use this resource pack. Use the lovely ones listed down in the description. Once again, thank you to all the people who made the mods that I'm using. They're wonderful. Um, please stick around for the next one. Thank you. Bye.